Uh, let's get to the story everybody's been talking about over the last few hours, and that is the, the trade of uh, the unicorn. Christoph Porzingis, who has voiced his displeasure uh, with management in New York, wanted out uh, and gets his wish traded with Trey Burke, Tim Hardaway Jr., and Courtney Lee to Dallas. And the Knicks get Dennis Smith Jr., DeAndre Jordan, and Wesley Matthews. And they potentially have all kind of cap space to try to make a splash in the off-season market for big-name free agents. Uh, Shaq, when you heard this had gone down, what did you think? I mean, I knew Porzingis was, uh, you know, not not having his way with with, with management, and then he forced a trade. And, you know, they gave it to him. I think it's good for Dallas. You know, you got two young European stars that will definitely play well together. Uh, on, on the other hand, New York uh, creating 75 million cap space. The question is, can they lure a big time free agent to come to New York? I know it's a big market, and everybody likes New York. But the question is. With the stuff that's been going on with management, can they lure, uh, you know, Kevin Durant or a big-time player to come play in? Or a Kyrie Irving yeah. or a Kawhi Leonard, you name it. What, you, what, what was your initial impression, Charles, when you heard this was going down this afternoon? I like my chances with Porzingis and Doncic going forward. I like my chances. To me, first of all, we can't say anything about about the Knicks yet, yet. But like Shaq just said it. Oh, that cap space don't mean nothing unless they it's get guys. It's a huge guys. if. Yeah, it's a gotta... huge if. And then, because you're going to have to sign somebody. And if you sign guys who aren't superstars, who are just good players, it's going to kill your franchise for the next 10, 15 years. Let's say, hypothetically, they don't get Kevin. Uh, they don't get Kevin. Say Jimmy Butler and, Ky and um, Kyrie. No, no, not Kyrie. Um, Jimmy Butler and Kemba Walker. That doesn't, that'll get them to the seventh spot right. in the East, right. and they'll be dead for the next 20 years. I mean, you can't, when you, Ernie, there's, there's, how many great superstars in the NBA? Well, you say, we can build around this guy five. with five. There's five guys that no matter what position, where they are, you can build around them or we'll take your team. I mean, I think that's uh, LeBron. No question. Kevin, KD, yep. KD yep. James Harden. Yep. Kawhi. Kawhi. Yes, Kawhi. Anthony Davis. Anthony Davis. I, you, Kawhi. You, I, I would say Kawhi over Anthony Davis because it's uh, proven that he what he's doing in Toronto and what he's done in San Antonio. Yeah, but Toronto got a really good team. But, but I'm saying Anthony Davis is probably five on the list for me instead of four. Okay. But, 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 but if they don't get some of those guys, or they're going to be, it's going to, because you know how those New Yorkers are. Oh, and, and Greek Freak. Yeah, yeah and Greek Freak. God forgot about him. But I'm saying, you know how people in New York are. They're going to have to spend that money. So if they don't get, because remember a few years ago we had this argument. You said, who's the big winner tonight? I said, Amari Stoudemire. Because those other teams didn't get LeBron and those guys. The Knicks had to spend money, and they gave it to Amari. Quickly on Anthony Davis here, what do you think New Orleans is going to do? And how quickly will they act? I think they will react very quickly. Uh, rumor has it that they took him out of the, you know, pre, pre oh, they warm did. up. Yeah, they took him out of the thing. So obviously they are having conversation. And hopefully they're smart enough to get three or four pretty good players because you, you don't want to just let that guy walk away one and you don't want to get nothing. The leverage is now. Him. Well, let the me leverage say, is now. Oh, well, let me say question. this too. Adam Silver need to block that trade. Why? Uh, I, I don't like what the Lakers are doing. I don't think it's right. I don't what think What the Lakers are doing? Yes, I don't think what, what did they do? We're collusion. Like and you know it's collusion. How's it collusion? Well, because you know <laughs> listen. How is it's it collusion? Business. When you share an agent, it's with, business. listen, let's tell you something. Rich Paul got mad at me because I said a month ago, I said, Oh, the fix is in. Anthony Davis going to the Lakers. This before all this rumor started. And he says, Charles, I don't he didn't like me saying the fix was in. The fix has been in. I don't. I, I think Commissioner Stern, need to, who I like a lot, need to come out and say, "Hey, we can trade out to Davis, but he cannot go to the Lakers. Uh, we cannot have players and agents colluding to stack, to, to, to stack super teams." Adam Silver needs to say, "Out Davis, we love you." You can't have players. We can't have players dictating who gonna play together. But they, time out. So how'd you so get to a, as a player? I got traded to you. So, but I'm saying as a player. You demanded that trade. No, I did. No, you, I did. You're saying as a player. I don't like the. Another fact player couldn't say, "Man, I would love to play with you one day, man. Let's get the, if you if you want to do it, I'm ready That's for it." That's not what they're doing right now, Kenny. They're stacking the team. The agents, uh, guys are sharing agents. They're stacking team. That but ain't that, right. I'm not gonna. I'm not saying that you that 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 practice doesn't exist. But that practice exists. Guys who have the same agents. 
have all through time. They've never stacked they've their teams like the they're teams trying to do now. Because of their agents, and yes. sometimes they weren't a good player. No, listen. That's t and wait, and agents who have relationships on. with team, Just that's how coaches loud. have been hired yeah. over the years. Just that not is as the loud, Trust. It, it, listen, that's we, not unheard of. This, yeah. this is the one that just comes out and hits you like a thumb in the eye just because of the relationships there with the agent no representing question. LeBron and with Anthony Davis. So what? And then coming out. Because he's good enough to get to the next player. By the way, he has no intention of signing with New Orleans. He can only go to, first of all, then he said, I'm gonna only go to the Lakers, and if I sign, if y'all trade me to another team, I'm leaving after next year. Yeah. That is 100% collusion. And Adam Silver needs to say, that's God, business, no, Chuck. That's it's business. not collusion. It's yes. I want to be. Ta it's, it's tampering. How oh, if, it. if Magic Johnson oh, calls it. them and say, Magic This Johnson? is what we need to do. That's collusion. That's but as an agent, and you're sitting with your Come clients, on, and you're talking about the future on, of your clients, it's not. Listen. Collusion. That is the future of the client. But, this, this but the bottom line here, if you're just joining us, there was a big trade today, but it wasn't Anthony Davis. It was Kristaps Porzingis going for the We ain't going to play in anymore. Somebody, if everybody, <laughs> listen. <laughs> come on, man. This stuff is getting ridiculous. Yeah. If, we, if we're not going to compete on the basketball, uh, listen, if we're not going to compete in basketball, we're just going to have one or two super teams. Just let me know. Our but, job is to do our job. Yeah, Got come it. on, man. Give me a break. Was everybody else shocked when Charles used perennials in the right context? No. 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 He went to Auburn. What is perennials anyway? You used, you used the word. Like perennial all-star. Oh, perennial all-star. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention. Now, wasn't paying attention. attention. now see, now y'all got me hot. Because I can't believe <laughs> you, who used to be a superstar, and you, who's a, a hell of a competitor. It's a new generation, Chuck. all right for these. It's for a new generation, Chuck. I didn't say it's Chuck, now, if agents it's a new and, generation, and, Chuck. And owners are having these side deals. That's a different <laughs> Come on, man. We're going to take a break so you can put your earpiece in and we can talk to Nico Jokic after this.